In today's video, I'm going to be telling you guys everything that you guys need to know about Masteries. Basically, if you guys haven't heard, Mastery is going to be a brand new progression system that's going to be added into the game. And every single brawler is going to have its own Mastery Road. There's a lot of stuff that I need to dive into for this video, so let's just go ahead and hop straight into the video. Alright, so first off, every single brawler that you guys have once the update drops, or it's already live right now, every brawler is going to start off at Mastery Level 1. Now you guys are probably saying, Brent, how the hell do you gain Mastery Points? Well, as long as you guys are winning games, you guys will be getting mastery points the best news is that you actually will not lose mastery points if you end up losing a game so the only direction you can pretty much go is up now it is going to take a lot of grinding so you guys are going to have to be very patient but i think that this progression system in general is going to be a good step in the right direction for the game now mastery points will actually scale depending on your trophy range for your brawlers that you play on the ladder but also depending on your power league and your club league rank that will also dictate how much mastery points you guys get per win what's actually pretty cool about mastery points as well is that if you get star player you'll get an additional 20 mastery points it might not sound like a lot but trust me it's gonna make a huge difference because you need a lot of mastery points if you guys want to reach the end so every single mastery point is gonna matter also yes some of you guys might be wondering oh brent is there like a maximum that you can actually hit in a day yes so six thousand mastery points are the max that you can get in a single day once you hit that you gotta wait till the following day until you can start unlocking mastery points again it doesn't matter if you use it all on one brawler for that day or you spread it out amongst a bunch of other brawlers it doesn't matter once you hit that at 6,000, you're done. Another interesting fact about Masteries is that the, it doesn't reset once you finish the Mastery Road. The reason I'm doing Road like this is because I actually don't know if it's um, called a Mastery Road. I'm gonna call it a Mastery Road. <laughs> so yeah, once you reach the end of the Mastery Road, it doesn't really matter. Because say, for example, like the Trophy League Season Reset, how it resets at the end of every Brawl Pass or whatever it is, I forget. Once you master a Brawler, you keep that Mastery. So I really like that feature. Another thing that's pretty cool about Mastery is that when you're loading into a game, you actually have have the new loading screen you have like the battle cards and stuff like that so your mastery points will actually show on the battle card and the enemy team and your teammates can actually see like what mastery rank you're at for that brawler so i think that this is a solid feature because you can see how good your randoms are or how good your opponents are it'll help you gauge and you can also strategize and be like okay maybe i'm gonna stay away from this brawler or maybe we gotta do a 2v1 pinch on them because they might be a little bit better granted yes i know mastery points is not a hundred percent definite that the enemy might be good you know they could could just play a lot of brawl stars but not be that great at the game but i think there is some correlation so you can take mastery points with a grain of salt sometimes but it is a good thing to keep in mind when you guys are looking at the enemy team or your teammates when you guys are playing with randoms all right so now let's go and talk about kind of like the rewards that you guys are going to be getting from the mastery progression system of course you guys probably know you guys are going to be getting like an exclusive pin you guys are going to get an exclusive emote but best of all you guys will be getting that player title at the end of every single mastery for the brawler you will get a special exclusive title that you guys can flex on your battle card or your player card whatever whatever it's called and you guys can flex to all of your friends and you can grind out pretty much whichever one you want to get first you don't have to like spread out your mastery points evenly amongst all your brawlers if you want to get like say pam's one first or you want to get mortis's one first you can go ahead and grind that out right away now yes i know granted you have all those amazing exclusive rewards at the end of the mastery road but you know what is actually very solid is the other progressional rewards that you get at like the beginning and middle of the mastery road i think that this would be a solid addition and a huge help for free to play players but also pay to win players will benefit drastically as well so for example for epic brawlers and below you'll get 225 credits you will also get 300 power points and 2000 gold for every single mastery so if you multiply like 225 credits by 65 brawlers yeah you guys can do the math and so on and so forth for gold and power points mastery in a nutshell is going to be a solid progression system if you think about it that way but like i said earlier i think free to play players are going to benefit drastically and i love this for the free to play players because because people were always complaining you know especially like how danny said in the brawl talk oh you know people are always asking for more gold because gold is so important when unlocking like gears gadgets and star powers now you're going to be getting even more gold from the mastery progression system along with like getting stuff already from like the brawl pass for example so progression should be improved and you guys should be getting brawlers maxed out a lot quicker now now kind of going off of what i said like how you can get a lot of the progressional rewards at like the beginning to the middle of the mastery road i think that this is going to be good long term for the game because if you don't really like playing that brawler but you want the progression reward
rewards like the credits power points and gold you can just play that brawler not an unhealthy amount and you can still get the rewards that way it shouldn't take too long but for those of you guys that are hardcore players you guys are tryhards you guys are sweats whatever it may be you guys can grind out whatever brawler you guys want and of course the more exclusive rewards are going to be harder to get so it's going to take a lot more time and i think that will be a good testament to see how skillful you are how much patience you have and how much you really play the game so i like the fact that yes for the casual players it's going to be a lot easier to get the progression of rewards and also for the players that really love a brawler or they're really try hard you know they're hardcore players you can get those exclusive rewards and flex on pretty much everybody now a personal thought that i have that i really love about the mastery progression system is that i really like that supercell is adding this because it's going to promote play rate a lot more hopefully masteries will keep players retention a lot longer they'll want to play the game more those hardcore players are going to want to max out their mastery points every single day granted i think that will be kind of unhealthy for a lot of people but i know there's going to be a lot of people that are going to want to grind out every single mastery point that they can get every day to try and progress as much as they can so i think that this is a solid benefit to the game in the long term and i think that the game is going to be looking pretty fun now well anyway guys that's going to be it for today's video if you guys think i missed out on anything that i need to talk about masteries let me know down in the comments below or if you guys have any lingering questions that i did not answer make sure you guys go ahead and leave them in the comments below as well but yeah guys that's gonna be it for today's video if you guys enjoyed it make sure you go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button make sure you guys also go ahead and turn on post notifications a lot of new content is gonna be pumping out in the next couple of weeks so i'm super excited about that make sure you guys go down in the description below follow me on my social medias join my discord and subscribe to the second channel make sure you guys also go ahead and follow me on twitch but yeah guys i think that's all i got for now thanks so much for watching today's video i love all of you guys thank you so much for all the support and i'll see you guys in the next video Bye.